As millions of Americans prepare to board flights during this busy holiday travel season, airports across the country are getting ready to ensure safe travel for all. And TV6 Kayla Page is live at the Quad City International Airport this morning. And Kayla, you have more on how they're preparing for any winter weather. Good morning. That's right, Dustin. I'm at the Quad Cities International Airport this morning, where it's not busy here at the moment, but they're gearing up for a busy travel week to come. And with winter weather brewing across our region, comes a need for an increase in winter weather preparedness. And the Quad Cities International Airport is prepared for whatever is to come. Winter weather preparation is a big deal around here, um, as it is with any airport, because again, we are part of the infrastructure of the airport. We are what's you know controlling how the building is set up, how the airfield or conditions are cleared. So we have a staff um, that gets trained starting in October about winter weather. They are trained on machinery. They are trained on our airfield geography, trained on when they have to start clearing weather, how that whole chain of command works. It's a pretty complex process. We have two teams that work 12 hour rotating shifts if there is winter weather that's incoming, and we to start clearing almost immediately. There is very little time for there to be any type of coverage before our teams are going to be out there cleaning runways and taxiways to make sure that air travel can continue. So I would say we are very prepared for winter weather. Now, Davis went on to say that staying on top of your air carrier's mobile app will ensure that you are up to date regarding any delays or cancellations. And she said it is fully an air, airline carrier's decision regarding any cancellation or those delays in particular. Live in Moline, Kayla Page, TV6 News. Kayla, thank you. And as always, you can tune in to here at KWQC TV.